Governor Sheima Kinde of Oyo State says the late Obalami Diadeyemi III, a laughing of Oyo, lived a life that had great impact on people across Nigeria. Makinde stated this during his condolence visit to the family of the late traditional ruler at the palace. I've been here to uh, uh, commiserate with uh, the immediate family of uh, KBC of uh, uh, the late uh, Alafi of Adeyemi the third. We are money. We're sad because uh, uh, KBC left us. Because no matter how old they are, you still don't want them to go. But we're happy also because he lived a fulfilled and impactful life. He made impacts. I've received calls from all over the country, from the presidency, uh, from my colleagues, uh, from uh, uh, the Sultan of Sokoto, the Emir of Kano. I mean, all of those uh, points to one fact that... Uh, 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 he has impacts beyond uh, or your state, beyond or your town. So we're glad and we're happy that, yes, Kabizi has gone to be with his ancestors, but his impact, you know, uh, has been all over uh, the country. So Ibagani Adams. The are rare on Akakanfo of Yoruba land had this to say about the later laughing. Firstly, he's a father. He's a leader because uh, I'm, I'm one of the product of his cabinet. And uh, he's a lecturer. He's a monarch that God blessed him with wisdom. And uh, sometimes he's a comforter. When you have an issue, when you get to him, he will comfort you. And uh, he's a monarch that we can call a deposit of history, deposit of knowledge. And it's a rallying point. Uh, it's not easy for somebody to be in front of a, a laughing for 52 years and sustain that position in a peaceful way. So we lost him, not only in Yoruba land, he's a global figure. Nigeria as a country lost him when we need him most. So definitely, it's a very big factor that I believe that uh, it's only God that can fill it back. Minister of Youth and Sports Development, Sunday Dari, said his death was a great loss to a your state in Nigeria. His death is... Um, very unfortunate, regrettable. Uh, we had expected him to be around much longer because of his wisdom, his intellectual depth. He was a lover of sports, a boxer, but also was a true Nigerian. His death is a great loss for your state, especially the people of his kingdom, but also for Nigeria, because amongst the top uh, emirs and rulers and obas that we have, is one that has lent his voice to national issues and developments. And when you talk about sports, it's about unity, about peace. He was a promoter of peace and unity and an investor in the young people of our country. And I think that's a legacy has left behind that uh, we um, must learn from to work together in unity and to seek to promote peace amongst our people.